Hi guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm gonna do my Virgos. My Virgos, my Virgos. Computer's plugged in, hopefully it won't die on me. Just died on my Pisces. So many things went down in that Pisces video. Uh -huh. Got cut off. Anywho, we're, we're, I'm focused on Virgo. My Virgos, my Virgos, sipping on my low. Alright, so this is gonna be December 3rd to the 17th, 2019. My Virgos. So, um, this is your energy. It could be vice versa. I am going to briefly touch base on surrounding energies. So, we have temperance, everything in moderation. What do we got here? Seven of Wands, being big and brave, going after what you want. Look at those goldfish. Got the strength card. You could be dealing with a Sag, a Leo, fortitude. It's like you want it. You want something. What do you want? What do you want? Property. Two of Cups popped out. At the bottom of the deck. All right, my little Virgos. What is going down? There could be an addiction to drinking. I, I don't really see it like that right now. Um, but there is something that is causing pain. And not that it's, it's necessarily card speaks of toxic. It does to me. It's hazardous for your health, whether it's stress or worry. It doesn't necessarily have to be addiction. You know what I mean? But enough where it's like enough's enough like you're tired of being in the same situation type energy tell me about temperance for my my Virgos There could possibly be a sex addiction, but just with the Sag energy on top of that, someone definitely turned someone on. Tell me about the Knight of Wands. Because this temperance is all about moderation. Okay, there's not a sex addiction here. Some of you there most definitely is, but the Knight of Wands is upset. Um, it's like time after time, time after time, someone's stuck on the past. There could be an alcoholic problem and, and somebody started drinking again and somebody's just like, what the frig? Why are we going down this path again? Um, and it happens quick out of the blue, no, out of nowhere. Someone could have picked up another habit, but this is telling me right now somebody might deliver a message regarding the past tell me about the five of cups but this isn't this is energy of like time to get out of time to release this like time to get out of this like it looks like the the knight of wands was out first so they're releasing anything that was no longer serving them so that's positive they go from that to the sun that's, that's growth. That's positivity. That's not negativity by any means. That's somebody getting out of this phase. It's like a little bit of an awakening too, but no. Well, yeah, for some, but it's more, could it be speaking of a Leo? Yes, but it's n not for everyone. This is, you know, turning, turning that frown into a smile. Being big and brave within the next two weeks when it comes to taking action with something. Tell me about the Seven of Wands. And if you're drinking a little more than normal, take it easy on that. You got the moon. So it is, it's nerve-wracking because somebody's going towards the unknown. Okay, um, 
Somebody wants to open up and communicate. And they need the strength to do it. Tell me about strength. So it's hard for somebody to even open up and communicate. But they're going to. Someone's getting out of a messy situation. This just flipped but didn't pop out. Ten of Cups. But I feel like this has something to do with a home life that wasn't going good because it was reversed and then it came out upright. But at the bottom of the deck is the Three of Swords reversed with the Chariot moving away from that situation, moving away from drama. So I'm going to pull again on Strength. But that was a story for someone. Which would make sense why the Five of Pence would be here. Strength. Seven of Wands reverse. So someone's not standing up for themselves in some type of situation. Some, it could be something legal. It could be a marriage. It could be dealing with a Libra. Some type of commitment that's no longer a commitment that's definitely over. Someone has anxiety about a new start. So yeah, there's, there's something ending for something to start. Could be involving a Leo and a Libra. And someone no longer is going to fight for a Libra or a Leo. But having enough strength to take themselves out of something. I'm going to talk about it with you. Tell me about the Five of Pence. Too many. Page of Cups came out though. Nine of Swords was reversed but didn't come out. Tell me about the Five of Pence. So this was somebody that was in this energy that's coming out of it. Okay. So yeah, looking at something differently. You got the sty could be down with an Aquarius. But this is whatever you went through, you had to go through and you're still going through it. It's just destined. Doesn't mean it's easy by any means. But there's something. Like you may be so like bent out of shape about moving forward about with something but there's nothing but blessings and happiness coming your way okay so stay positive because in the next two weeks something great looks like it's going to happen you're getting out of the funk or somebody around you is and things are going to get a lot better Virgo my Virgos, my Virgos. Beginnings. There you go. You got openness at the bottom of the deck too. With that Ace of Swords makes a lot of sense. But this is it. Beautiful. It's the start to every at the start of every endeavor, you will find the nature. This is an indication that a new energy is on the horizon for a new open hearted opportunities. Pay attention to what's going on. A new beginning can sometimes have a deeper spiritual significance, encouraging a different consideration of the of a fresh approach on how to connect with your inner guidance or someone else with awareness and understanding. One belief to this one benefit to this new stop may be an opportunity to stay true to your own path and guidance. Release what no longer is in your vision. Trust yourself as as you need to at this time. Your inspiration is positive creativity finances and love are flowing just before you ask a nation to assist you with this new energy and opportunities ahead of you so absolutely beautiful i i saw that coming here right off the rip so it's, it's gorgeous it's it's just hard for somebody it's hard for you guys to go towards the unknown they do have to leave something behind it could even be some type of legal marriage document something work i, I don't know having the strength to do it but they're going to because they want this it, they're following the you're, you're following your destiny your purpose your happiness super positive congratulations so let's see what the surrounding see what the surrounding energy is like for my little Virgos right now you guys were so clear cut so somebody somebody around you has some guilt let's wait too guilt about a situation or is definitely getting out of the energy of the five of swords which is positive and you had you also had two fives over here okay so somebody's wrapping something up 
it could even be a commitment or this is what went down with you guys this could be if it, it speaks of work they're traveling for work they got themselves out of a situation maybe whomever you're leaving I don't know whose energy it is but it could be across seas Everything was destined to go down the way it was supposed to. It looked like something definitely ended a career, a family, something moving forward. We have the high priestess again. Destiny is, is here. Could be dealing with the high priestess. You guys are going to both take off on the boat together. Someone might have a family. You just got to wrap up. This is the end of guilt, the end of stuff that no longer serves this other person okay so out of all my zodiacs yours was extremely clear cut and i'm so thankful for that i really truly am i just looked down it was 11 11 didn't i start your read at 11 11 that was either you or it wasn't you what did i do right before you Pisces. You might be down with the Pisces. But just know you're, whether you're cross-watching or this is you, things are about to get to get better. I mean, you go from, from this in two weeks to this. It's a blessing. It truly is. Something about a lifetime here, too. Okay. Whatever's next is, is meant for your life. But you'll be doing it your whole rest of your whole life. I don't know what that's forgetting. Could be a relationship. She so have the Ace of Swords here, too. Somebody definitely wants to talk. Congratulations. Enjoy the new stat, my little Virgos. You deserve it. Bye.